I do plan to do all the quests. I'm going to get the platinum, so I plan to do everything in the game. I don't know if I'm going to do some of the quests now, because most of the quests are just fetch quests, so most of them don't even involve battling, so I might save the quest till, like, again, we get all the characters. I think the plan is going to be this. Get every single character. No, will that work? Possibly. Get every single character, then focus on a bunch of quests, finish the main story, then focus on the cleanup for the Platinum. I think is how it's going to work. See, the game isn't going to take long to finish the main story. The playthrough might take a while when it comes to, like, weapons and all that. So I don't really know how long the playthrough is going to be. The, the main story will probably only take, like, two or three streams at this rate, it looks like. I'm not even two hours in and we're like gates, but I can't help thinking we're walking into another trap well not much we can do about it except keep our eyes peeled come on if you don't mind I'd like to go in first and make sure it's safe your majesty very good we'll hold here for now we got a chest here I forgot war, war zones have chests do we need to get every single chest in a wild zone or a war zone? I have to double check the trophies. I don't know if it said every single chest in the game or it just said every chest in a wild zone. Stand fast here and prepare to attack. Either or, it shouldn't be too bad, but still. I don't know which one it is. I'm going to save up my tension. I'm not going to use it now. Hey, bro, what's up? If you insist, turn around. <laughs> even though I don't need it. Now we got power throw, which is good for wide range. Frizz. Goodbye. I think I'll play as Desdemona a bit. I don't hate playing as Desdemona. She's in the mid to low tier of characters to play as. Mainly because she's really slow and I just don't do slow characters. But she's she's got her perks that make her pretty enjoyable, especially compared to Tornico. In Dragon Quest Heroes 1, I think my least favorite character to play is, um, Doric. I hated Doric as a character and a playable character. In DQ Heroes 1. I didn't really like playing as, um, Doric. Rager into Parallax. I love Parallax. Desdemona is like a more fun Genghis. Genghis is pretty cool. I Genghis is pretty fun to play, but Desdemona is uh is slightly is slightly better than Genghis. It looks like they're triggered by panels on the floor. Watch your step, everyone. That's unfortunate. If you insist. Cross-cutter throw! Easy. I'm be passing through if you don't mind. It's a good thing that worked out. Can't go that way. Do I have to go a different way? Or do I have to kill every enemy, maybe? Go away. Oh, okay. Oh, now I go to the door I was just at. <laughs> a way to make me backtrack, game. It's good that you're all mine. I will do great things with you. You will go no further, Harbin scum. Prepare to meet your doom. Something tells me they're not in the mood to negotiate. 
Little hatchet man. Also, something else they did in this game that I like. I don't hate Yangus, but replacing Yangus with Angelo was a good choice. Because I like, as I said, Yangus is the worst character, is the weakest character in DQ8. Dude, I just want to get the best girl. So badly. Time for high tension. Wait, we just want to talk. We don't want to see any more Dionysian blood spilled. Shut up. It's too late for that. Now come here and I made up. I got a medal in the middle of my animation. That's good. Old King's grave, your grave too. Come on, you lot. So many sheep. Don't feel bad. <laughs> Love that. Oh, I don't have tag tricks yet. Tag tricks is another good thing they added. I think I get those pretty soon, though. What's up, Teresa? Easy block. I don't really block too much in this game, but I like getting a good old parry every now and then. Do I have tension with you? Yeah, do this. Prepare to pay. Oh, I would have loved to do a hatchet man there. That would have been a pretty good finish. You stronger than you look. But Prince finish you good. My animation going through <laughs> during Dunk's talking is pretty hilarious. I'm only just getting warmed up. Whew, that's a lot dealt with. Does this mean we finally got to talk to we get to talk to Cesar? I hope so. I just know that when we finally do, it'll turn out there's a perfectly good reason for all this. You two really are close to the prince, aren't you? Which gives me an idea. Your Majesty, perhaps it would be sa safest to send these two in first. It may help show Prince Cesar that we mean no harm. Huh, a sound suggestion, Lady Desdemona. My sudden appearance may only serve to agitate him further. Apologies, my young friends, but would you do me this last favor? I believe it would go a long way for paving the road to peace. Just you try and stop us. Come on, Teresa. We got a wrong wrong-headed royal to talk some sense into. Alright. Make sure everything's all set. I think we're yeah, we're gonna go in with this team. I'm ready. Charging off on your own like that. <gasps> Cesar. Well, look who it is. What's going on, Cesar? Why are you attacking the Harbans? It's been a while, eh, your highness? Seriously, did no one ever tell you about barging into places uninvited? <laughs> what business is it of yours? Four more years of training, and still you lack the discipline to stay out of others' affairs. I'd hoped you might have learned by now when your presence was neither valued nor wanted. Alas, you're the same thoughtless child as ever. Yeah? And if I'm thoughtless, then what are you? Or have you forgotten all the stupid things I've seen you do, Prince Pautalot? <laughs> How terribly sophisticated you've become. Why? Stop it! Both of you! Is this really the time or the place for your bickering? In case you've forgotten, we came here to try and talk Cesar around. Talk me round? Am I to take this to mean you have turned your coats 
and sided with the Harbins. <laughs> you will regret that. Justice will be done. And those who betray our realm will suffer the judgment of steel! Your Highness, please, you have to listen to reason! Your friend is in no mood to listen. We have no choice. And we'll be needing your help if this is going to end well. Same old Cesar. Once he gets that look in his eye, there's no talking to him. You're right. We never could get through to him when he was like this. We sure couldn't. He's clearly got some stupid idea in his head, and we're just going to have to beat it out of him. Let's go! <laughs> this could be a pretty hard boss fight if we weren't overleveled. Maybe this still will be. Probably not, though. Justice will be done. Mercy shall not stay my hand. Same I'm frozen. Your princeliness. We're gonna beat some sense into you whether you like it or not. Oi, that's an old friend you're talking to. But it does seem like the only way to stop him. Cesar, why are you parrying so much? Who parries? Or blocks, whatever is your term. No idea what, though. It doesn't smell like a bad that's for sure. Well, bad you not. It looks like we're going to have to fight him. Let's get this over with, shall we? Have I ever mentioned that Cesar has a really neat character design? I like the way Cesar looks. Just his design is nice. Specifically his hair. Ow. Yeah, so C Cesar is like the wielder of the elements. He, he can wield every element. And this is like a crazy difficulty spike if you're playing an actual, uh, if you're in the first, if you're not in the NG+. I remember having trouble in this fight. Ow. Can't block. Curse you. Had enough yet, Cesar? Ready to put down your sword and talk like a... Never. Now suffer the wrath of Tunisia! Look, over there! Oh no, the archers are back. Caprice. Archers, this is really not a good time. Archers. We'll need to deal with them before we do anything else. I'm going for him. Ow. I'm frozen again. Cesar, stop freezing me. You have other elements. If you insist. There's one archer left. Get out of here. Go away. That was quite a jump you just did. I let go too early. I wanted to do a psych up there. Look, you can't block the freeze. Keep that in mind. Leave it to me. I think you're dead from the Inferno Slash. Or just normal combo attacks. Goodbye, Cesar. It was nice fighting you. Definitely would have been challenging if I was in a first playthrough. <laughs> if my teachers could see me now. Well, we didn't manage to talk him around, but at least we managed to stop him. I've never seen Cesar lose control like that before. What could have happened to him? Well, we'll find out soon enough, I hope. After all, whatever it is, the fates of two countries are resting on it. Speaking of which, we better head back to Accordia. The High King will want to get to the bottom of this as soon as possible. All right, good job, team. Trust me, that would have been challenging if I, this wasn't an NG+.
We have to look around before finally getting an audience. Never mind, we can just talk to Desdemona. Lady Desdemona. The prince's hearings is to be held in the throne room. The necessary preparations are being made as we speak. Thank you. Desdemona, you have to let us be there. We're going to be... We're going mad worrying about what's going on with Cesar. Outsiders aren't usually allowed in the proceedings like these without the king, High King's permission. But you, did, you two did play a crucial role in all of this. Alright, I'll talk to his radiance and see what I can do. Thanks, Desdemona. In the meantime, why don't you look around town? It looks like some new places have opened up shop since we were last here. Good idea. This is still not open. What's up? Quest counter where you can aid people from across the realm. Applying for each quest will offer a reward upon completion, so it's well worth your while. I hope we can count on your assistance. The seven realms need your what you got? What you got? Alright, I don't think quests transfer over, so we're gonna have to redo them. That's totally fine, though. I'm all down to do them all on screen again. Hello there, ducky, and welcome to my little alchemy hut. Never call me a ducky again. This is where you can soup up your accessories using all sorts of ingredients. Also, I love this. You'll find ingredients all over the place, in treasure chests, on monsters you defeated. Bring them here and see what you can make. Oh, I know. Seeing as this is your first visit, why don't I get you started? A pair of slime earrings. I think that just increases the chance of Helix helping you. Which, in this playthrough, seems kind of useless. For now, at least. They'll probably be useful later. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. We'll be messing with this a lot later. What's in here? Vocations is open. I'm finally ready to receive you. I can assist you in changing vocations whenever you wish. Oh, I can do it now? Nice. I didn't think it was so soon. I had her as a mage pretty high up. You know what? We should probably work on getting every vocation to level 20. So we're going to make Teresa a priest. Not a priest, a thief. Might as well focus on that. We can get that trophy out of the way now. Level 13, not bad. I was hoping you'd pop by. I've got some for you that I think you might like here. Alright, so this is a labyrinth dungeon. We're going to do this uh, now? Maybe? Yeah, we'll give it a try, probably. Blue dungeon solo. Oh, magic maze is done. Um, I didn't do domain of dead. We're gonna hold. We could probably do it now, actually. I'm gonna wait because we're gonna get Cesar soon. Yeah, we're done. All right, perfect. I think we're ready for this. 